West Misty. That means we're on the west part of the Misty Forest, I bet. Interesting. I don't even think Sue or Justin or or, or friends. I don't think they even know they're in the Misty Forest right now. I think they're just going with it. Oh my god! Oh my god. Scary. I don't like it. 51 experience points. Alright. They're gonna level up soon. This is a great song that's playing right now. This one's nice and it's chill and relaxing. Alright. I gotta explore a lot because I, I, I need to make sure I'm picking up all of the mana eggs. Oh, scary. You never know which way is the right way to go in these games. Like, there could be an item over there. Actually, there is an item right there. More moolah. Ugh. I wish I knew what to say. It's just a pretty game. Just a pretty atmospheric game. Man, these enemies... Th there are a lot of these enemies. I think they're new. They, they might be a recolor of an enemy we saw on the ship earlier. Oh my, what is this? Burn. Interesting. Oh, they pop out of the bottles. Oh, that's a cool design. Hit four at once, look at that. Oh my goodness. That is such a good move. Like, Burn has only uses one magic, and it hits a lot of the targets, usually, and it's really powerful. Well, it's kind of really powerful. For a move that uses one MP to use, it's powerful. Hundred and eight experience? Oh my gosh, that was a lot. Well, kind of a lot. That was twice as much as the previous battle. Yeah, I'll pick that up. Another piece of bread. What's it gonna be? Bayo fruit. Restore restores 10 SP to one friend. Yes, I will take it. I will. Alright, where am I going? I think I'm backtracking, but I don't mind because I don't mind exploring this area. Thoroughly. I'll explore as much as I need to. Yeah, this was the safe point earlier. Tree guy right there. Just walk around him. Another herb. A weak weed. Minus two attack level of en of one enemy. Uh, minus two. You know what? Fine, I'll, t I'll take that. I'll probably get rid of it later, though, but I'll take it. Alright. I think I got everything on this side of the dungeon. Well, not it's not really a dungeon in, the, in, in, the, in this side of the path. So, I'm gonna keep going forward. I'm trying to make sure I'm, like, getting everything. Which is why I keep spinning the camera. I'm making, making myself dizzy. I'm just trying to get a good look at the entire area. Alright. Nothing over there. Money. Uh. Uh. Ooh. The song just had some instru instruments added to it. Cool. Oh my god, I just fell. Oh, okay. I'm gonna explore more of this area first. Okay, I couldn't discover anything else on my walk around the village, so... I'm back here. This is Luke Village. I already told everyone here about you. And the village chief says he would like to meet you. He says he wants to thank you. I'll be waiting at my house 
So go and see the village chief, okay? See you later. Interesting. Who do we talk to? A lot of a lot of NPCs here. I'll talk to you. The folks here all have tails. They flutter them around like wings. I wonder if tails are very useful. Hmm, good question. We get our tails at an early age, though I've got nothing to compare it to. I wonder, is it inconvenient for you to not have a tail? There was a similar line of dialogue in Star Ocean, like that. They were like, oh, how can you guys walk around if you don't have tails? How do you, how do you keep your balance? Hey, look, it's the guys with no tails, the ones who came here with Rem. I'm so envious. I wish I could go outside the village and see all sorts of stuff. Maybe I should just do it like Rem did, even though the grown-ups say we're not supposed to. Aren't you supposed to? What's wrong? This is a great song. Look at look at that. Look at the mist below this area. This is very artistically done. This is the village chief's area. Is this where I'm supposed to be? I'm the chief of Luke Village. I heard that you rescued Rem. On behalf of the village, I would like to thank you. However, I must ask you to stay only a short while in this village. After all, we we are peace-loving people. What do you mean? You want us to leave? I wouldn't go as far as to ask that much. I mean, to ask to ask that, but this is this is hard to say. It's just, hasn't this village been visited by others besides us? Do you tell everyone to leave? No, that's not it either. It's just that to stay here, you must receive the blessing of the God of Light. So that's it. In that case, tell us how we can get this blessing. What do you say, Chief? All right, I will tell you. The God of Light who protects us lives at the top of the mountain behind this village. Go there and bring back the bottle of wine that is in front of the statue. That is how outsiders can come to be regarded as village, as members of this village. The truth is that I wish not to disturb the peace in this village, but you rescued Rem, so I have no choice. All right, that's our next mission. I think. Is, is, is that an instrument? What is that chiming sound? You folks might think that it's rather strange, but it is an old custom in our village. Once you're accepted by the God of Light, you will officially become members of our village. And then you can never leave. Is, is that what's going to happen? Go to the mountain's peak and take the bottle of wine in front of the statue of the God of Light. This is how outsiders can be accepted as members of the village, of our village. The truth is, I'd rather not send you there. I hope you already did, buddy. And we're adventurers. So we're going to go get that bottle of wine. So that's the next, that's the next mission. Weapons store. All right, what, what can I get? Welcome, we've got everything from hunting gear to medicinal herbs. If you're buying, have a look around. If you're selling, come talk to me. Let me see what you're selling. Oh, this bow looks mighty tasty. I might want that. That knife looks great for Fina. Or a staff. That's a weapon for Sue. Oh, I guess I should get her that. So she can learn some staff attacks. But it's also expensive. You know what? I don't need any of those items. Like, those don't look that incredibly important. And all of these look pretty good. Except for these shoes. These shoes I'm not going to buy. So, I'm going to buy... Yeah, look at that. I'm going to buy a couple of those. I'm going to buy one for Fina as well. I think Sue needs to drop some items. I can trade the ribbon for that, but for some reason, I don't want to get rid of the ribbon. So I need to find a stashing area so I can get rid of the ribbon before I can buy that. But I will buy this fairy robe for all the characters. There we go. All right. That all seems fine and dandy. wonder what new items they got here. Reduces SP used by killer moves. That sounds nice, actually. Puts all enemies to sleep by bubbles. Ooh. Fearless confusion. Unblocks magic of one friend. Restores 50 HP to one friend. Ooh. That's actually kind of nice. All right. Nothing here seems particularly useful. I mean, that does stuff. That that do, that that stuff does seem useful. I just don't want to buy any right now. All right, what is this? House one. It's a regular house. Mm, so new faces aren't you the kids out from the west who rescued Rem? Yeah, that's us. How do you know that? 
I'm the prayer. I'm the prayer leader of Luke Village. I offer prayers to the God of Light for healing, rain, and good hunting. Even more than the offering of prayers, I also tell old tales to the kids, and I tell people's few fortunes. So he predicted us. We are prophecy. Rem's house. Oh, that's a nice place. Oh, there's a stashing area. Okay, there. I just stashed a bunch of items. Now I can go buy that new piece of armor for Sue without feeling bad for getting rid of her ribbon. Yes, equip that. There we go. All right, Ram, how are you doing? Since we're going further on in your adventures, you should get some advice from the village chief. Yeah, he told me that I have to go to the sun god now. Thank you so much for helping Rem. Rem, did you think them properly? Of course. Good, so I hear you're traveling to the end of the world. Please leave. I mean, I mean, please feel free to ask the village chief any questions you might have for him. He already told me. He, he said, you know, you gotta... You, you gotta go get the liquid in front of the sun god and then I can be part of your village. I don't know. That sounds like a lot of trouble. I wonder if I should just leave. Nothing there, I guess. Nothing over here either, it looks like. Oh, there's a safe point, like, way in the corner here. And there are no hints anymore. Huh. Alright, so this door can open. God of Light Mountain on foot. Oh my god, we're actually- we're actually doing this. Okay. Oh my goodness, whoa. I guess just follow the wall until I can make it up there. New enemy right there. Alright, Eagle Eye View. Help me, Eagle Eye View. Uh, can I climb that? Yes, I can. I can't climb that. More money. I gotta Google how much money those actually give you. Like, I really hope it's not some minuscule amount, like, like, like five money or something. All right, let's see here. Seven o seven four. Seven one seven four. Nice. Okay, it's one hundred. Which is decent. That's like one healing item right there. Oh, I bet there's more on that mountain path down there. But no, I'm gonna keep going up. Ooh, look down there. This is some of my favorite type of imagery. Ooh, look at all this. Gonna be a mana egg? No. I, I love imagery where it's like mountains and when you look down you can see like the land below you and it's all foggy cloudy like I love that kind of imagery brand new whip right here mist whip plus 20 attack I guess I'll give that to Fina I think that shop was selling something better than that. Oh. What is this? Rust. Speeds up IP of one friend. Permanent. Ooh. Interesting. It's a one-time use permanent item. I gotta not use that lightly. Plus one all magic resistance. Is that also permanent? I doubt it. Uh. I right, pick that up before I before I do that. I'm gonna explore a little more, obviously, because this looks evil and important. This rock looks ominous. Why right, does this rock have a little creature with an eyeball on its chest on it? And this one too. Okay. I'm doing it. I'm gonna pick up the thing. 
Hey, here's the wine bottle. Now the God of Light will bless us. Our goal is the end of the world. It'd be hard for us if we get kicked out of the Luke village now. Okay, let's take it. Oh boy, and then the sun god comes down and we have to fight. Is that what's gonna happen? Mind of the gods acquired. Is that it? Is that it? Okay, I'm gonna run away. <laughs> Scary. All right. It seemed like something greater was gonna happen. It was making a weird ominous sound effect. Like, wow, wow, wow. And it looked like a cult circle, but I, I guess it was actually nothing. Item. A paracharm gives resistance to, par to paralysis. All right, fine, I'll take it. Sure, it, that doesn't sound that useful, but I mean, I'll take it. What is this? Life seed plus max HP, vaguely romantic seed. Yes, take that. Awesome. Justin learned burn flare. That's a level three magic I can finally use. Nice. I'm not gonna use it right now though. And the sword leveled up. Ooh, I got a lot from this battle. Over here, there's some money. Money right there. More money. I guess there's a lot I didn't pick up my first round through. Anything over here? No. I think that's it. All right. Oh, wait, no, that's not it. There's a thing there. Move break unblocks moves of one friend. All right, I'll take it. And way, way over here is some money. And that appears to be it. That's everything. Did, did I do everything there? I don't know. I feel like I explored that place pretty thoroughly. So if the one thing I missed happened to be a mana egg, then that'll be... That'll be kind of hilarious. That's just... That, that, that's the weapon store. The chief's office is over here. You really brought back the wine of the gods? And I have no choice. Now you all must drink some of that wine. Oh, uh, drink the wine. Once the wine enters your mouth, the god of light will accept you as one of us. You could just put the bottle to your lips without really think without really drinking. It's the symbolism, that's all. Or you could simply be on your way. You wouldn't mind at all, you know. Well, um, let's just pretend to drink it like this. Yes, the God of Light now regards you as one of us. However, the God of Light is actually evil. What? Please take my friendly advice and give up your plans. Toss away those unreasonable ideas. What's going on here? Unreasonable ideas. I heard from Rem that you want to cross the end of the world. To do that, you have to get out of the Misty Forest. Endless though it seems. That's right. Doesn't the mist clearing nut work for that? We would need something like that. Hmm, those nuts are very valuable. We've only got a few in the village. They can't be given away so easily. Take my friendly advice and do not attempt the crossing. If the if the end of the world, which is apparently a wall, if it's so hard to get to, then who built it? Man, how stingy. Now all we're hearing is, please quit. Please don't do it. Young man with the rude mouth. <laughs> we are not being stingy. The mist clearing nuts are vitally important to us as residents of the Misty Forest. They are treasures that our ancestors received from the Icarians. Icarians, you said? You mean the Icarians from the Angelou legend? Sir, you mean the Angelou legends are told here in Luke? Please, we want to hear them all. 
Oh, well, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to tell them. It'll take a while, though. According to an old tale from this village, in the distant past, the world was bathed in light. A glorious world the Icarians protected. They did not suffer old age or illness. It was a peaceful world, they said. Our ancestors stole the wings of the Icarians because they wanted to be Icarians too. But this was not a natural thing for people who had never had wings. And when those wings were attached to the backs of our ancestors, they turned black and blocked the sun from this village. The plants died first, then animals. We almost lost our light of hope. What a horrible time that was. To keep the darkness from spreading, the Icarians built a huge wall around us to shut our world off from theirs. That wall. That's the end of the world. Yes, the wall meant that our ancestors were left with the world that remained on this side of the wall. The Icarians were nice enough to toss our ancestors some special nuts, which can remove the darkness. Although the darkness was replaced by mist, we have since used these mist clearing nuts to light our way in the in the forest. Without the mist clearing nuts, even the Luke folk would not be able to go through the misty forest. Wow, you got the nuts from the Icarians. Now I want one even more. So what happened to the world on the other side of the wall? Talk to him again, Justin. Today the world on the other side of the on the other side is still a happy and peaceful place. They say that when we die, our souls return to the other side. The ancient land of happiness. Hmm, what a mysterious legend. Oh, I don't think it's a legend. I think, I think he's just telling it how it is. So, are the folks really serious about climbing that wall? I mean, are you folks really serious? Please take my advice and don't do it. No one has ever returned from there. Please rest, or at least for today. That's interesting. So, he's sort of implying that the other side of the wall is the afterlife. Because when you die, that's where you go. And no one has ever returned. Ooh. But I don't think Justin's gonna catch that memo. You may stay at Rem's house. Rem's parents would like to thank you for rescuing their son. I'm dead tired. How about you, Justin? Hmm, yeah, anyway, let's rest up today. I'm gonna keep talking to this guy. Please go to the Rem house now. Rem's parents are awaiting you. Please take it easy and rest a while. So, am I reading this correctly? Is that true? Is the other side of the wall the end of the world? So when they say it's the end of the world, it's like the end of our world. It's the end of our existence. And then we go on to a new realm or world. Once we cross it, that is interesting. That is very interesting.